as I've wandered the paths of the ancient Celts with their love of nature, I've found inspiration that's not only musical, but personal as well. And so, when it came to choosing the songs for this compilation, the journey so far, it wasn't hard to find things that still speak to the yearnings of today. People ask me, well, how is it that I get involved in the Celtic music from coming from Canada? And my response is that in Canada we come from a very, it's a very multicultural society now. It's a country that has uh, a lot of immigrants and, uh, from all over the world. So um, in that sense, I suppose one could call my music world music. I suppose one of my favourite tracks is the Mummer's Dance. I learned that mummering still found in various places around the world and is a kind of wacky musical Halloween where people dress up, play music and dance the set while visiting different households. And we had a great time shooting this video in the west of Ireland. Well, I've also turned to the language of great poets to inspire me. They give me such a rich palette with which to paint. Shakespeare, Yeats, St. John of the Cross. And I love the evocative imagery in narrative poems such as The Highwaymen or Tennyson's Lady of Shalott and bringing those stories to life. Lancelot mused a little space He said she has a lovely face God in his mercy lent her grace The Lady of Shalott There's a wonderful quote of Lao Tzu's. It says, A good traveler has no fixed plans and is not intent on arriving. The journey so far is like a landmark on a quest still fulfilling itself. And who knows where the journey goes from here? <laughs>